so much for clicking on my video. So today I'll be unboxing actually only um, each version of the MCND, the new MCND Earth Age album, and then my fan signed signed album, and then some of the fan signed like kind of goods that we got because everyone went group order. Surprisingly, got all sealed albums. So even though I did buy forty six, I'm only going to be unboxing three. Uh, yep. Well, let's get going. Okay, here are the Earth Age albums. Uh, which version's which? Hmm. I believe this is Earth, and I believe this is Kepler version. So unfortunately, for this era, um, I only applied for one fan sign because your girl broke, and NCT twenty twenty is coming. So I'm dropping major cash on that. Uh, yeah. There's so many October comebacks. Like, what even? I swear, bruh. All multi like stands who like collect are like broke. Just broke. Um, so I'm gonna start out with um, Kepler version because it's why not. All right, so I believe this is the Kepler version. I'm just gonna keep saying this. Um, so yeah, wait, I think, yeah, I think this is supposed to be the version. So yeah, Kepler, yay. Okay, so it says Earth Age right here. I'm CND first mini album. Yeah, all uh, right, wow, lots of stuff right there. Kepler, Castle J, Big, Minji, Who Did Win, and this is like all that kind of stuff. Um, and on the side, it says MCND first mini album, Earth Age, and then nothing, and then it just, as like the Kepler 1649C thing. And then we'll show you guys the back. Um, so these are the kind of track list. So there's the intro and then there's Na Na Na, which is obviously the title song. And there's Breathe, Beautiful Galaxy, um, Bumpin' and then the outro. <clears throat> Personally, I really, really, really love Beautiful, but like Galaxy, literally all the songs are just so good for this compound. Like <clears throat> they're just so good. Like I can't even choose a favorite, honestly. This is MCND, it says Earth Age, Kepler, and then Top Media Stuff, first mini album. So yeah, that's it for like the outside. Now we're gonna go on to the inside. And so I actually really like the packaging for this era. <laughs> Cries. Um, so yeah, as I was saying, I really like box kind of packaging just because it doesn't get damaged as easily and it's just way easier to keep in general. Um, so this is just a photo book, you know, here we go. I can already see the bookmark, which I'm not going to look at yet, because on this channel, we look at bookmarks last. So I'm going to leave that. Oh, darn. <laughs> I got a group card. Oh, no. I mean, okay, I collect group cards too, but I was really hoping for some Castle J and Wind, just because your girl collects them. Um, well, rip. Anyway, so here, <laughs> uh, moving on. <sighs> Here are these stickers. This is Castle J, Big, Minju, Hu Jin, Win. They have like their own kind of thing. And obviously here's Win, Big, Castle J, Hu Jin, and Min Jin. He's like the Earth Age and like the little symbol thing for this album. And then this is the CD. It's just the same color, honestly. And then it has the kind of same pattern as you can see in the sticker right here in the front of the album. So I'm saying D from this first mini album, Earth Age. I kind of like the design, honestly, but I don't really dig the color. Not gonna lie. Sorry. <laughs> anyway, going into the photo book. I'm just gonna do a really quick flip through of the photo book. Um, yeah, just because. So the lyrics, and then here's like where they're all like the group picture stuff right here. I actually really like these clothes. Like I think I think the I think it looks really nice, honestly. Like it matches, you know? They kind of went for like a sporty theme. They're all wearing like, you know, those kind of shirts. Except for like Castle Jane Wynn. I feel like besides them, like they went for like more of like a street theme. And this is kind of like what they were wearing when they, um, when they're like the beautiful kind of, not really envy, well, yeah, when it came out. Are they allowed to advertise like that? <laughs> Coca Cola. <laughs> anyway, so here's like the kind of like a more, old stuff photography I guess it's like you know when I think of this I think of like like disco and like um like rollerblading I guess rollerblade roller skating roller skating yeah <laughs> I guess I don't even know if it's the 90s maybe the 80s I don't know but it's it kind of it's like that um that kind of how should I say this what was it it has like that glow to it I don't know what to call it, it just has that glow 
And then obviously they're all wearing yellow here. I believe that the first couple pages of the album was supposed to be the same. So yeah, that was it for the photo book. And I'm going to go into what I got for inclusions. All right, and this is what I got for inclusions. We already know that I got a group photo card. Oh, well. Um, well, not really all well. I did kind of want it, but yeah. Oh, and then I got Bix bookmark. Uh, he looks great, first of all. Uh, unfortunately, I don't collect him, so your girl's gonna have to be trading. Yep. All right, moving on to Earth version. All right, here's the Earth version. I was right, so this actually tells the Earth, uh, the version. Yeah, the version. Okay. Um, it's like the same thing as like the Kepler version, just Earth Age, MCND, first mini album, Kepler kind of stuff. Um, Cast J, Big Minji, Hu Jin Win. Personally, I kind of like this one better just because um, I've mentioned this multiple times in like my videos that I just like kind of like blue black themes like better. So yeah, that's really all there is to it. I really just like it better just because of that. I do believe I saw the inside like photo book. Oh, it came a little dented. Well, oh, that reminds me. I want to talk about Make Star Shipping. Um, Makestar did a way better job than usual, um, in my opinion, just because they actually, um, they used a decent amount of bubble wrap per, like, stacks of albums. Like, I believe that my, I got, I think they spent, like, three kind of layers of bubble wrap for every around seven-ish albums, which sounds really bad, but honestly, it's way better than a couple of other sites, and... Yeah, like overall, like nothing really came that damaged. Like this is like, honestly, like I've given up on having like perfectly nice albums when it comes to like group orders. Like they're going to be dented in some way, to be honest. Anyway, so track list, MCND, Earth Age, Kepler, first mini album. Yeah, now we're going to open it. All right, time to do the shaking thing. Okay. That was way harder than it needs to be. <laughs> Does anybody else open their albums like this? <laughs> Is it just me? Is there an easier way? Can somebody please tell me an easier way to open my albums? <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, <laughs> I just me suffering. So I know now that the photo card and the bookmark are gonna be here. So I'm not gonna show you guys that. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna just do the photo book first and then I'm gonna go into the inclusions afterwards. This is here, Earth Age, MCD, first mini album. And then, you know, just the blue theme. Here we go. It looks so good. What even? I feel like this was supposed to be the album's like, um, that's a light, more colorful kind of thing. Yeah, okay. Does, okay, not gonna lie, Minji's hair low key reminds me of the Joker. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Yeah, that reminds me, MCD. They had their first concert, yay! Um, what was it? The Gem Age. They had their first concert, Gem Age. Um, uh, personally, I wasn't able to watch it just because I was busy with some stuff. Uh, Big Rip. I knew I wouldn't be a watch. I, I wouldn't be able to watch it. So I didn't buy a ticket. But I did buy their merch. So, uh, I what was it? Um, I did buy three sets of their merch. Um, one of them my friend bought, and the one of them obviously I'm gonna keep, and then the last one. I actually plan to sell. The reason why I bought three sets of merchandise um, was simply because I wanted to save on shipping. Okay, this is just so good. Honestly, like, I really like this page. I don't know why. Okay, not gonna lie. I kind of want to like clearer pictures, but I also kind of like the aesthetics where they like shine a light into like different places, you know, kind of like that. Like that's that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. I respect that. Or like they're hiding like half of their faces. Honestly, I kind of like clearer shots better when they're not covering any part of the face. But I can like respect like that. This does look nice. It looks nice. It looks nice. Well, honestly, like after unboxing Regulate albums, like practically any album that comes with different pictures um, from the other versions is considered nice to me. Like I have very low expectations now, but I honestly think this looks nice. I think they look good. They look good. They definitely look good. <laughs> yeah, I just really like the theme of this album better, I guess. Like um, the way, I don't know. I, I just like the clothing better, I guess. And like, I like the photo shoot kind of like concept in general, kind of like where they look more like shadows and like kind of stuff. I just like that better. That's just a personal preference. 
Um, the funny thing is, is that I feel like a lot of people have mentioned this when they're unboxing their albums. Um, considering the fact that the album cover was blue, I was expecting for a blue theme, and then most of it's red. And I was like, okay. <laughs> so it was the red album. The red album was kind of like that, not really like vintage, but it's kind of like that yellowish kind of like, there's like a yellowish kind of film over it, I feel. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's just my eyes and the fact that I can't remember what it's called. Uh, yeah. Anyway, they're all wearing yellow. <laughs> And then here's that. This is like the before they released the album. They like for concert photos. There we go. Yes. I know how to speak. That's a J. Big Min J. Hooligan and Win. Yay. Okay. Now we're moving on to my inclusions. All right. And here is the inclusions. Okay. Today I got a member. Oh, I got Casa J. Hey. Yeah, girl. Got him. Anyway. So now I just need wins. That's pretty good, actually. Um, so anyway, here is the CD. It looks so pretty. What even? Uh, NCMD, first mini album. And then, you know, the kind of logo thing that they have, I guess, in front of the album. And then Earth Age. Oh, yeah. As I was saying about the MD, um, the merchandise sets, I am selling one more set. So if you guys are interested, you know, comment down below. DM me Instagram, Twitter. Uh, for certain things such as the shirt and I honestly the keychain too uh, I don't recommend buying from me if you're not in the US just because it's gonna be like expensive <laughs> uh, so yeah Cassidy's J's photo card a blah, blah, bookmark and I got Pujin oh my god okay not gonna lie I don't collect him but this photo card is mm, it looks so nice like what even he looks so good i love this shirt on him like in the like in the mv i like constantly repeated some of his parts just because our boy like yes get it anyway so this is the back of the cards it's earth age of cd first mini album and then obviously hujin um so yeah what was i gonna say oh yeah uh it was so funny because i heard um i saw on twitter even though i wasn't able to watch the concert i saw some people's like comments on like what happened and apparently like mzd dressed as girls and like they're doing like some, some skits and stuff Kind of reminds you of attention. I feel like top media is trying to keep that agenda going. Anyway, so Huijin, I believe, was one of the... F what, what, I can't remember if he was one of, the, one of the only members or if he was one of the few members who didn't dress like a girl. And he said it was because if he dressed like a girl, like, it would be over. AKA being, he'd be way too beautiful. <laughs> that confidence. We love a confident king. Anyway, so Cassie J, Big Min J, Huijin, Win, And then they're actually in different orders in the other sticker set. So here's Win, Huijin, Min J, And then Big Castle J, the Earth Age sticker. And then like the logo kind of thing. So that's that. Oh, and I want to show, I forgot to show this earlier, the back of the group card I got. So usually you would expect it to look like this, like vertical, but this is actually horizontal. I kind of like this actually, because usually group cards don't come like with horizontal backs, um, which don't really bother me too much, but I still kind of like it. The fact that if I go like this and this, like just the writing is the same. It just makes me feel better. That's just a personal preference. So Earth Age, MCD, First Mini Album, Kepler, MCND. Yep. Oh, here's the group card. I will be keeping this, so yay. And now moving on to my fan sign album. All right, it's MCND fan sign album. So for Make Star, um, they actually signed individual pages. Personally, I do like individual pages rather than a full sign album. Uh, yeah <clears throat> that's just a personal preference of course um and the reason why i put this here is just to remind all of you if you do get this authentication card please scratch this qr code off and um look in the back of your album right here there's going to be this um thing like this barcode and then you're going to go to who's fan on your phone and then you're going to scan the qr code and you're going to scan the um, barcode of the album that I just showed you and then your album will actually be like confirmed um tagged been bought and will be sent to Hanteo chart and it'll help the boys in like winning music shows and stuff like that so it's actually really important that you guys do this so just remember please scratch that off I know I haven't done it in here but I will don't worry anyway um and also the second reason why I have this year is because it has my name and I prefer not to show that so yeah the nice thing about fans and albums um that they always come with like this wrap around it i'm honestly really lazy and i don't really like like 
buying or looking for things that will keep my friends out of them safe. I know that's really bad, but usually I have stuff on hand that'll like make it safe so I don't have to worry about it. So I'm like really grateful that like they already give this kind of like film already. So yeah, I'm gonna move on to the inside, the actual sign stuff. I was being a dum-dum and then I realized that the part with my name on it was on the plastic wrapping rather than the album. For some reason, I thought that like the little like Thing that they had with my name on it would be on the album and I realized I'd be really dumb <laughs> so in conclusion I just don't think <laughs> anyway here we go inside of the album okay all right so here's some more card stuff oh my god I see the Polaroid oh <laughs> I'm gonna show it like surrounded by a couple of stuff because I don't want to exactly show it because it is like, how should I say this? It is the sign Polaroid that I got that's also undisclosed. I prefer not to show it for now, but yeah. So I'm gonna put this to the side. It looks beautiful, by the way. Um, and I believe these are the winning Make Star cards. Honestly, this looks exactly the same as normal Make Star cards. Like, what the heck, like, Make Star? Like, you're supposed to give me, like, special cards, were you not? Yo, my dude. Anyway, and this is just, like, the normal version. So I'm not gonna show the inside or, like, the other stuff and so i got minjay's bookmark and then oh my god oh my god i got a castle chain card oh. Oh. <laughs> dang this is actually pretty good it's not bad not bad oh my gosh oh. anyway <laughs> so yeah i got the group card that i did need in the end um well i'm gonna need and then i got a catholic j photo card um unfortunately i am still missing win's bookmark so this min j and that um big bookmark will be up for sale or trade to wins yeah and then i guess i'll be unboxing not really unboxing just showing it later but i'm gonna move on to the actual like fan sign pages Okay, and I'm just gonna like take a really careful look because I don't want people to see my name. Also, I don't know where they signed it. So this is like, you didn't sign it anywhere like weird, right? Because there's some like pretty dark pages and I'm like, please don't have signed black on black. I swear. If they sign black on black, this girl's gonna be real sad. I'm gonna be a real sad. Did they not? Oh, okay, wait, wait. I saw it, I saw it, All right. Here we go, here's Castle J's page. Not gonna lie, I kinda wish he picked a better picture. It's okay, he still looks wonderful. All right, so this is two, my name, and then here's the pictures on this page. Now, I, I, as I said, I just prefer close up shots. So I would've preferred if he signed it on like this page, for example, but they always sign it on like this kind of page. Anyway, so here's his signatures. This is Castle J, like the little heart. I really like the way that he puts like the crown, like it's just so cute. Uh, now I'm gonna flip to the next page. No, that's still Castle J. See, I would have preferred it if he like signed on like maybe like this or like not this page because he is wearing black. If he wasn't wearing black, I'd probably prefer it on that page. Okay, and here's Min J signed page. So this is obviously to my name. Here's Min J's signature. It kind of reminds me of like the oh my girl like symbol because it kind of looks like a tiara, you know? And like, <clears throat> I don't know, it's, it's, it's kind of honestly hard to like see which, which part is actually... The letters is supposed to be but honestly i can never talk about messy changes signatures because people are always like hey it's like you know it's okay like your signature is supposed to be something that you can't read anyway something that is supposed to be like really hard to imitate so i guess like i did a good job in that case because my signature is completely like unlegible so yay <laughs> i did my job of creating a pretty decent signature um but honestly some idol signatures are like really messy but not like i can say anything too but um, honestly like there's some signatures which are really like really like you know like ido and like sahos from like oneness like they're like you know they literally just write their names which honestly there's nothing wrong with that i'm not hating on their signature style or anything i'm just saying that they literally write their name in korean so that's just a type of signature style and there's people who like to decorate a little bit more like min jae and the people who like or like kind of other kind of stuff. All right, and we're gonna move on. Oh, just wanna say one more thing about the Minji page. This picture is beautiful. It is such a good job of picking, of like picking. That reminds me, people, I guess, wanna know if like you get to choose which pages they sign. In a normal fan sign, yes. In an online fan sign, no. And so here's Huijun's sign page. He looks so 
so good. Like, yes. Although I do prefer them facing forward. I think a side view, like a 45 degree view is also, yes. And so here's his signature. Wow, I really cannot tell where everything is. Like, I can... Wow, okay, I believe something is supposed to be the eyes. <laughs> There's the J. Can I tell anything else? It's okay. It's beautiful. And this is obviously to my name. And then they had a little heart. Oh, so cute. So yeah, there's Fujin sign page, and then I'm moving on to wins. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna look for wins. If I can ever get there. Yeah, there we go. Wow, this is sad. All right. <laughs> no, my boy, you really signed black on black. Oh, stay at NCT. But what? What? Yo, yo. You can't even see that signature. Do you see this? You don't even put like this. Like, you can like barely see. Oh my gosh. I big sad. Anyway. Uh, he did put a heart next to my name though. That's cute. Um, Actually, by the way, I forgot to mention this earlier. But I am planning to sell individual fan side pages. Just because I don't keep them. Unless they're from the first fan side I do for the group. So yeah, I already have Ice Age sign page, so I'm not collecting Earth Age sign pages. So if you guys are interested in any of these, I'm probably going to have to make Win cheaper, honestly, just because of the fact that he signed Black on Black. Whatever. Um, But yeah, just letting you guys know that it is going to be signed to my name, and because um, I want everyone to respect my privacy, so if you are going to post your fan sign page anywhere, please do cover my name if you're going to buy from me. Just like, if you can. Or just... Don't mention you got it for me, baby. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I just prefer not to have my name just leaked just because it is kind of a privacy issue and I'm still not, I'm, I'm still a minor. So I prefer not to have my information leaked even if it's just my name. So yeah, but I am selling these pages. So if you guys are interested, you know, comment down below, DM me, Instagram, Twitter. I will be shipping worldwide um, just because they're just pretty much pieces of paper. Um, I'll be putting like plastic or like something over it to protect the page and then I'll put it on cardboard and then I'll be sending it. I would recommend everyone to get track shipping just because, um, just in case, because I don't want these to get bended, obviously. Like that'd be really bad. Um, if you're worldwide though, I would probably suggest doing um, just stamp shipping unless you're willing to pay like 12 bucks, honestly. So if you guys are willing to, you guys can definitely do it. But if you're not, I don't recommend it, honestly. Uh, I'm probably going to be making the fan sign pages like 25 to 30. That's what I usually see fan sign pages for going. But if I'm like overpricing or if I'm like underpricing, which I kind of doubt I'm doing because it sounds a lot to me anyway, um, I'll be putting better prices on like my Instagram page or like my Twitter or something like that. So yeah, uh, if you guys want to see like any of the new stuff that I purchased, well, not purchase that I got and have decided to sell for reasons, then let me know on my Instagram. Follow me on Instagram on my main Instagram page at Carrot. That's a very good way to get to me. Yep. All right. And Makestar said that I was supposed to get special photo cards, which is so weird to me because honestly, this is what I got, and these are not like special, or they're not different from like the usual Make Star cards, in my opinion. They look exactly the same. Like Make Star, you liars. <laughs> Honestly, like they're lying because they said they're supposed to send like a special like ten set or whatever, but like these look exactly the same as like what they're what they're like usually give. Like what even? Yo, I was kind of expecting something like more special, I guess, like different, but the fact that they're kind of like the same is like, mm. all right, I don't even know if the versions are the same, like they're probably not on like the back. Yeah, see, there we go. Uh, I guess I'll put blue on top. Yeah, there we go. Switch that. All right, there we go, all the versions. So this is the Kepler version of the Make Star photo cards, and here's the Earth version of the Make Star photo cards. So they didn't give me anything different, because honestly, like I got all these set because you're supposed to get two per album, but I guess because I won the fan sign, they gave me the entire set for one of my albums. So I guess I have extras now. <laughs> Question mark. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll be selling my extras because I already have 
the ones that I need for my collection. So I'll just be doing photo card counts and then I'll be showing my Polaroid at least a little bit, a little part of it just because I don't want to show the entire thing. And yeah, that'll be the end of the video after that. All right, this first one. So there's two Huijin cards. These two bigs. Let's see. I'm really just laying them out right now. <laughs> okay, three. I'm hoping to get like a decent like amount of each. So as I said, um, I actually bought 46, and obviously these are not 46. Um, so you're supposed to get two per album, from what I remember. And okay, wow, this is not looking that good. <laughs> and usually, if you buy even amounts, I would expect to get like an even amount of like an even distribution, I guess I should say. And me, I don't know. I feel like they've been pretty good with that so far. Not gonna lie, the album card and the Mixed Art card look pretty freaking similar. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, usually if you buy even amounts, you just expect even amounts of each card, you know? You know? But like when I was opening up my big package of 30, just because um I was just looking for the Mixed Art cards, honestly, I noticed that it was definitely not even. I was like, wow. Make star cannot count. Yeah. See, look. <laughs> it's okay. I got a lot of um this version of Min Jae in like my other set of 30, so whatever. <laughs> Pain. Uh, okay. I don't know. I don't I don't really think I'm getting a good distribution. I cry. Alright. Yo, what even? Make star. <laughs> Y'all can't count. <laughs> All right, yeah, no, they can't count. Uh, so I'm just gonna do quick counts now. So here is the Earth version. I think I said it differently before. So there's three of this ver Earth version, and then there's, oh God, one, two, three, four, five, six of the Kepler version. And then there's one, two, three, four, five, six of Vic's Kepler version. I really like this card. It, it looks just so nice. And then I got, here we go, three of Vic's Earth version. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of Min Jae's Earth version. And I got, that's so sad, I got two of Min Jae's Kepler version. And then I got three of Hui Jun's um, Kepler version. Yeah, it's Kepler. <laughs> and then I got four of Hui Jun's, sorry, um, Earth version. I really like this card, like the background and like everything. It just looks so good, it's so good. Uh, also, Make Star be lying on the photo card previews. If you guys look on the Make Star page of like the fan sign stuff, they actually give a like, they actually give a picture of what the photo card is supposed to look like. And they said, okay, yeah, they said it's subject to change, but some of the cards, like, actually no, I'm pretty sure that every single one of the cards that they showed as a preview were different. Like all of these are different. I swear. Like, yeah, some of them are similar. Like I think Bix card, this card, and this card, I think were somewhat similar, but the rest of them were like completely different. Like I don't even know what happened to Hujin and Bix. Like they were just so different. Anyway, so I got four of Wynn's Kepler version. And I got four of his Earth version. And because there are 15, sorry, 16 albums in this one, 32 times 2, 64 plus 8, I swear I can do math, 72. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> anyway, so I was supposed to have that many. I guess I count later on and see if Make Star is missing anything. And moving on to the Polaroid. Right, I know the picture is really small, but this is the photo, the Polaroid that I got. I got Min Jae. He's doing like a little like V. So cute, honestly. I would definitely keep, but I actually don't collect Polaroids, even if they're my biases. Um, so I'm definitely gonna be selling this Min Jae Polaroid, but I do have a couple of offers already for it. So I don't know if. It hasn't been sold by the time I post this video. I'll definitely put something like down below right here. If I don't, then it's been sold. So yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna show you guys just the signature. So this is a signature. Honestly, I'm so happy that he used like a thinner pen for this. It's so cute. The way he signed is just so nice. 
But yeah, that's it for the pol the signed Polaroid that I got with my fans and album. Yay! And I'm gonna show you guys the posters. All right, here's the first one. It's basically just um the Earth version one. Yeah, it's kind of like the Earth version where they're all wearing kind of like darker colors, I guess. It's like the photo that I showed you guys in the photo book. Here, it's kind of big. All of them come folded, unfortunately, if you get them from Make Star. Whoa, what is that dent? What the? Do you see this? Is it supposed to be like that? Why is there such an obvious dent right here? Do you see this? Like, look, do you see that dent? What even? Is that supposed to be there? Look! Oh my god, it was dented because of this. Yo, Make Star. What even? I guess I'll be keeping this one just because I feel bad. <laughs> anyway, oh my gosh, that's so weird. I was like, what the? That's such a perfect imprint, though. Like, <laughs> I gotta say, it's a pretty perfect imprint. Anyway, so there's all this. Here's their poster. And then there's like this barcode thing on the bottom that I don't understand. Uh, probably gonna be doing that later. So, yeah, that's their vertical version kind of one. Ah! And then now I'll be moving on to their Kepler version poster. Yep. Okay, and here's the Kepler version one. Honestly, all of them are in bad shape just because they've been folded for so long and they've been like squished under like so many albums. <laughs> so there's nothing you can do about any like poster damages, honestly. Yeah, unfortunate. So here's the Hepler version. I really like this one. I was actually expecting the other one to be popular. I don't know why, but this one is actually extremely popular as well for good reasons too. They look beautiful. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna be hanging this one up. Yes, yes I am. So here's Win, Huijin, Minja, I didn't call them out on the other one. Rip. Um, and then here's Big. Uh, what do I say? Castle J and then Big. Uh, like, see, three of them are wearing, like, jerseys, and then there's Castle J and Wynn, which I guess are wearing, like, more, like, I guess Wynn, like, what Wynn is wearing is considered more, like, streetwear, and Castle J is kind of, like, it, it's definitely athletic wear. It's definitely athletic wear, I think. Yeah! <laughs> anyway, it's a couple of version. Um, I didn't, I didn't mention anything for the other one. Because I have this two focus on imprint. But it says Earth Age MCD first mini album and then like the Kepler number stuff. So yeah, that's it for the poster. Unfortunately, I can't fit all the members. Wait, did I? Yeah, no, I did. Never mind. JK. Um, so yeah. Alright, this is obviously not my entire haul for today. I box like way more cards. Um, but these are the things I'm gonna be selling. Obviously, no, the albums are mine, I'm keeping those. Um, but I am not really selling. Um, I'm gonna be trading the bookmarks, so Minja and Bix, they're gonna be up for trade to wins. Pujin, I really do want to keep him, but I know that if I keep him now, I'm going to want to collect him. And three members of MCND for all album cards is a little much for me, especially when I am going to start collecting and hype him because I'm whipped for Jay's, Hangun, and Hisun. Like, I don't even know if I want to collect them, like, all three, if I just want to collect, like, one or, like, two, or, like, a mismatch, like, combo. Or I also want to collect Sonu. But if I collect Sonu, I kind of want to collect, like, Jungwon. If I want to collect Jungwon, I want to collect, like, Jake and like Nikki and I'm like what even right so anyway I'm just gonna stick to what I know because right now I'm gonna be Castle J and win so I'm sorry Hujin I'm probably gonna have to trade you so I'll be trading for either um Castle J or wins because I don't have any of the earth ones and then uh by some off chance if you guys are interested and in even <clears throat> in like I guess trading to wins Kepler version I'd be down for that too um, because I already have Castle J, so I don't need that one. Um, I am going to be buying probably the other group version. This is the Kepler version that I got, so I'm probably going to be buying the Earth version. I'm not going to be trading, um, just because, I mean, like, this is a really unfortunate fact, but, like, it's just known that the group photo cards just don't go for as much, and so, yeah. And also, a lot of people sell their group photo cards, which is easier. I just want to, like, finish castle j and win first before i finish my group cards so yeah that reminds me i'm still looking for one of the ice age group photo cards which is really weird because i pulled a lot yeah anyway so this is basically my entire haul for today this is what i'm selling so these three cards and then some and then the fan sign pages 
of my Kepler Vision album. So the pages that I showed you, they're all for sale. All of the members. I'm not keeping any of them. So yeah, just um just letting you guys know it does have my name on it. I prefer if you are gonna post it at any point in time, please do cover my name with like stickers or like I don't really care. Just please cover my name if possible. But yeah, basically it'd be all yours if you do um if you do buy the pages. I don't know why that like so like yeah. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video today, please click the like button down below. If you want to see more, please click the subscribe button down below. Check out the rest of my channel. Um, because I do a lot of fan side unboxings, which are usually better than this. Um, and then if you want to get notifications, please click the bell icon down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!